all right guys in this video i want to show you how you can try to target rich people using facebook ads and instagram adverts before we begin my name is noel and i make videos like this so if you like videos like this you should subscribe to this youtube channel that's if you're not yet subscribed and equally you should like this video so that um youtube can show this video to other persons who would be searching for videos like this this means the video will do well and then i'll be happy and you will equally be happy so without off the way let's begin so i know at some point you'll be trying to reach people who you think have money people who who then buy your product because um sometimes you the people you are targeting or the people you are reaching with your adverts they don't have money and they are not going to buy because they don't have money and they, they they are not going to kill themselves just to buy your product so you start thinking of ways to try to reach um rich people you see what i did there i'm trying to reach rich people wow incredible so how do you do this because let's be frank it's it's slightly challenging to reach them so how do we do that on facebook so first you need to come to your facebook dashboard this is the business manager and um, you should have an advert already all right so we just need to create a new ad for this so i'm just going to come here and create a new ad so i'm just going to choose any objective because we don't really need to do anything here we are we are going to the the um, ad set level where we can target people i'm just going to cl click next here and then we continue and um we come down where we target people which is um somewhere here yeah here where we have um, our detailed targeting so this is where everything is done so if you come here you notice that facebook's facebook gives you an option to target people through their demographics their interests and their behaviors all right traditionally when we target people we use interest because we think they are interested but being interested is not enough because I can like something, I can be interested in something, but I cannot afford it. And I do not actually have the plan of um, buying it anytime soon because I cannot afford it. It doesn't mean that I am not interested. I am interested. I like it, but I just cannot afford it. All right. So how do you fix this? So um, instead of using um, um, just interest, you can use behaviors. Because when we talk about behaviors, you're already talking about what people are doing. All right. So if you are looking for people to buy something, Facebook is now looking at people who are already buying something. So let's say if you want to sell something to, to um, somebody who just has an interest and somebody who is already um, buying as a behavior, you know that the chances of selling to the person who is already buying is way higher than somebody who just is interested. All right so this is where we should be focusing on on the behavior so i'm just going to click this to edit it so if you edit it if you come here facebook gives you the option to browse so once you browse you can browse through the behaviors the interests and the demographics so instead of just using the interest like we traditionally would you can look at the behaviors all right so now if you come to the behaviors you see that um down here we have different kind of behaviors all right so from the first one we have like um, anniversaries says anniversaries within um 60 to 90 days so if you are looking at uh, maybe you sell cakes or you sell things that are related to celebrations or events you would know that it's not just um enough to target people who are interested in anniversaries all right but see these guys who have these anniversaries so they are planning towards the anniversary they have this as a behavior attached to them so this person the chances of them buying is way way higher than just looking at somebody who has an, an who has an anniversary as an interest all right so you can come to consumer classification but i don't think this is um open to nigerians so if you are watching this video from many of these listed countries you can use this so if you if you're in argentina it says people who prefer high value goods in argentina and people who prefer um, mid and high value goods all right so if you are in india indonesia malaysia pakistan philippines 
South Africa, Turkey, and the United Arab Emirates. This would be very, very important for you. So you can target these people based on these behaviors, all right? So if people who already prefer high-value goods, if you sell high-value goods, you know that these people, they are pre-qualified already. It now depends on your offer and how you can close. All right, now let's come down to digital activities. So these people who are interested in open um, operating systems, Canvas gaming, blah, 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 game, consoles, Facebook payment gateway, and all of that. So this is a behavior. Let's say you sell a digital product or any kind of product, and you are looking for people who are interested in some kind of um, um, activity or who have who have um, involved themselves or their businesses in some kinds of um, activities like these ones it means people have used facebook payment users in the last 30 days so if you are trying to reach advertisers like me or you watching this video you can see that some of us who must have tried to use facebook payment gateways in at least in the last 30 days in the last 90 days all right or if you want to look at people who have um, used some kind of device all right so this one is people have accessed Facebook through older devices and iOS operating systems. So if you have a need to target just Facebook business admins, you can see that you have them listed here. Um, page admins, um, club and page admins, Facebook page admin. This is a business page admin, food and restaurant, health and beauty. So Facebook will be showing these adverts to people who only have this behavior these guys they have these behaviors because they have pages like this and they've been operating as admins all right so you can target people through their internet browsers use people have accessed facebook through chrome through firefox through internet explorer and all of that all right so you can even look at just small business owners all right you can look at just small business owners let me go back and looking at the behaviors small business owners and all of that so now we come here where it says purchase behavior and this one is very very common most times when people run advert they use this to narrow because this is engaged shoppers if you come here you see that facebook is telling you that these are people who have clicked on call to action buttons before so you have an advert that um, people have to click on the call to action and these guys they've clicked it so they are engaged shoppers. They are, their chances of buying is much, much higher because they are used to landing on people's sales page. As you can see, it says here in the last, in the past week. All right. So this, if you come as a purchase behavior, this is the only one we have as engaged shoppers here. So this can help you narrow to people who are already used to buying things. So again, if you are trying to sell some kind of product, you you think the people who buy these things they are people who are wealthy people so you see this target in here this option that says frequent international travelers we all know that people who travel frequently across the country or across countries they are supposed to be worthy they should have money they should have money so we are targeting these people because they are frequent international travelers so they are flying planes around the world of course they should have money so you see those who have returned from travel in the last one week and returned in the last two weeks all right so these these ones are frequent travelers these may not be um outside the country but they are equally traveling they are equally traveling as a behavior all right so this is a kind of targeting that will be helping you get more um accurate bias than using just interest all right it's not like interest doesn't work it does work but these ones are behaviors already so people are exhibiting that already so their chances of them buying is higher now let's look at the demographics so if you come here you can see that through people's demographics you can find people who are at some certain educational level so as you can see if you are if you have a product or a service and you are trying to reach people who fall within any of these categories you can see them people who are high school graduate doctorate college grad associate grad people who are still in college people who are in high school people who are in, in grad school people who are doing their masters professional degrees some college some grad school and all of that even through field of studies and through schools all right even through financials you can come through people their their financials 
all right this is not available to nigerians too i think this is just available to to the u.s market all right or to the u.s audience so you can even target people who are parents or people who are in a relationship and all of this so these are already behaviors and they'll give you better results than just targeting um interest so this is one of the ways that you use to target rich people with your facebook and your instagram ads i hope you like this video um like this video if you like this video wow this is what i've been doing all day so if you have any question you can put it in the comment section of this video and um, i'll get back to you i'll reply your questions that's if you have any so that'll be all for this video i'll see you in the next one thank you for watching my name is noel bye bye